introduction to SPSS part B so let's take a look at uh, what we want to be able to do with SPSS uh, data files, output files and SPSS files so first of all in an SPSS data file it's important to know how you can go to the data view and insert and delete cases and variables if you right click on a case there's insert cases right click on a variable insert variable left click clear left click clear uh, other ways of doing that include using uh, these icons up here for insert cases and insert variables. You can also go to the var variable view to um, delete a variable, clear, and we can also use Control Z to undo anything that we've done before. Sorting cases, right click on a variable and then sort in ascending or descending order. This would allow us to see that Uganda is the country with the lowest female life expectancy in 1995. Uh, richer sort can be achieved through data sort cases. In this case, for example, we could sort by religion first and then female life expectancy within that. If we now go back to our data file, we have our cases sorted first by religion and then by female life expectancy. Recoding can be done via transform. Generally it's best to recode into different variables, that way you keep the original data and create a new variable with recoded data. So let's take female life expectancy as the input. Uh, life expectancy female R, for example, is the output variable. That will be a new variable. Click on old and new values. And we then establish the rules for the conversion uh, from one scale to another. So I'm going to suggest that the lowest through to 69 years old will be group 1, or be given the value 1, and countries with female life expectancy from 70 through the, to the highest value, a value of 2. This is also a good chance to demonstrate the use of syntax. So in this case, click on Paste then go to the syntax screen, highlight the commands and click play or run. The output shows that the command has been conducted and if we now go to the data file we should see at the end of the data file a new variable called life expectancy F R for recode. We can then go to the variable view and add variable labels. So one was low life expectancy to high life expectancy. If we go back to the data view now, we can toggle labels, value labels on and off and you can see here that we can also change the data and we can toggle back to the data.